I do? Work like I still got something to prove. Let's go. All I do. Work like I still got something to prove. <laughs> What's up guys? So, really exciting to have uh, Yvette and her husband in town. We had tons of fun, got a lot of good workouts in, and I'm super excited to see who uh, the next winner is. So Yvette won my first challenge, so we got two weeks left to find out who wins my third challenge. So, you can kind of sit up for that one, and then straight to your face. Yep, perfect. What's up guys? Dale and Bailey here. We have special guests. We got Yvette Wild and her husband Christopher. Um, Yvette was my first ever contest winner. She won the Purpose Challenge. It was a it was eight weeks, right? That was an eight week challenge. She can't talk right now. I have her working out the eight week challenge, and she was my winner with the best transformation. Um, we've been. You guys got here Saturday. Yeah. Been. They went to the rodeo. We went boating, we went surfing, we hiked in Glacier, and we've been training the last three days. So, I'm gonna put them through the last bit of my shoulder workout, and then I have check-ins to do. So, I'll update you after this. But I wanna start off by kind of thanking you guys. Um, the last video I put out, I was sort of in like a weird spot, being super vulnerable, but I always feel like, I, will, I like to like keep you guys up to date on and I like to be honest, so if something's not going right, I'm not gonna pretend that it's going right. So I just like to put it all out there and if you can get something from it, I know I got a ton of mes messages from other people trying to figure out like how, how I fix myself. Um, people dealing with hypothyroid, I'm dealing with hyper, you kind of deal with it the same. Um, so I appreciate all your messages, so I think I'm just gonna kind of keep you guys up to date with everything. So, this is how I look like. <laughs> um, I, I look great, I get that. In my own head, and obviously it's not always the right head, I, lo I lost 10 pounds. I think, to I think I totaled 11, I, my lowest was probably 126. I'm back up to like 128, which is a really good thing. Um, Last week was the first week I actually got a pump. I actually enjoyed working out. I was filling up a little bit, which is good news. That means I'm kind of on more of the recovering side. Obviously, I want to get there a lot faster. Um, but again, I'm not obviously like super pumped with how I look. I lost a lot of muscle mass. Um, but yeah, I know I don't want to like bum people out and be like, oh, guys, you look great, dude. You know? I was like, I know, I look okay, <laughs> I look good, <laughs> but I always wanna look better, I wanna be stronger, and I think the thing that I'm most frustrated with is when this happens, because um, I know the first time, this was like a long recovery the first time, but the gym kinda goes away for me, because I'm, I'm very weak, I'm very tired, I fatigue really fast, uh, I can't do cardio because my heart rate's too high, so those are the things that like kinda make me most sad is that like the gym is like a huge struggle because you're you're losing motivation my motivation is like training hard and training heavy and when you can't do even a quarter of the weights that you could do four weeks ago it it hurts your motivation a little bit and makes training a lot harder but good news um i'm in to see my naturopath next week um she's basically who fixed me the last time i have an endocrinologist um, I'm also seeing an endocrinologist out of Toronto that specializes, she's an athlete herself and she specializes with athletes, knowing that like, okay, like you lose a little muscle mass, like I should maybe stop training, but she knows I'm a little cuckoo and I'm not gonna stop training. I wanna keep trying to maintain as much muscle mass as I can, even if I'm still losing weight. Um, so she, I did labs last week. We're still waiting back on a couple labs. So she's gonna give me a full report. We did everything. And I think that's one of the things you guys can do for yourself is like, if there's ever an issue, find someone that can get you a prescription to get everything done. Um, last time I tried to get it done, I had to lie about like things issue. Cause I, I want to know everything. Your blood is gonna tell you everything. So. We're gonna hear back from that soon. Um, so positive note, 
Uh, I'm feeling a little bit better. I'm not losing any more weight. Uh, I'm not getting any stronger, that's for sure. Uh, I'm still very fatigued and tired. Haven't been doing cardio uh, because my heart rate has been 100, so cardio just elevates that. So I don't want to elevate it any more than I already do. So that's positive is I think I'm on the other side. So I think I know all the signs and symptoms from the last time, so I'm able to like notice it a lot faster and like get on my med back on my prescription medicine and the supplements that my naturopath had me on to get me in the right direction. So hopefully by next week, maybe I'll add a pound of muscle. <laughs> that's, that's the hopeful part. So we are in uh, the start of week five. Um, we only have two weeks left, little one day less than two weeks. So you have to have everything in. So if you guys are watching this and you're doing the challenge, it ends on the 19th. So start thinking about getting those progress picks done next week. Um, yeah, this is the final push. This is the, like, if there are any tweaks that you can do to your diet, like, oh, I don't really need this, let's take that out. Or adding a little more intensity to your training, adding a little more intensity to your cardio, or adding maybe an extra five minutes. Do all the things you can now in these last like couple days. You got, what is it? 13 days left. And then we get to pick a new winner, which I'm very pumped, very excited. I've been watching you guys on the Facebook group page and following along with your progress very silently. So stay tuned next week. We're in recovery and we're in our final week of the DLB Summer Shred Challenge. See you next week.